You hate to hear it. The Tick and Professor Show. I actually love to hear it. I don't know about you. No, this one you're going to hate. No, I've actually heard understand. this one already. Yeah, I've already heard this one. And this one. is sad. But I, it makes sense. I, I, I don't know if I know this whole story, so I'm going to let you tell me the story because oh, I had well, heard I the headline. Heard oh, no, 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 I, no, no, no. But I mean, I, you know more than I do. I've only read the headline. Okay. So, All right. uh, and our, it's about, hold favorite. on a second. Yeah, no, wait, let, let me bring him up on screen. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got I'll, this technology. Just, there he is. Uh, uh. I did it faster than you could imagine. Yep. So our, one of our favorite actors, Bruce Campbell. Yes. Said he's given all that he can to the character of Ash. Yes. Which I, I mean, he's 63 years old. Like yeah. what more can yeah, you Yeah. What give? more do you like, want? Like literally, <laughs> right. I think they've tried to kill him on every single movie set. Evil Dead 1, Evil Dead 2, and the Army of Darkness. Right. Like they tried to kill him on every single one of them. They do, <laughs> speaking of which, on Army of Darkness, did you ever see the behind the scenes of uh, some no. of the? Okay, so Army of Darkness has some great behind the scenes, and one of them is Bruce Campbell on a contraption that Sam Raimi designed that literally looks like a medieval torture device. Oh, he no. had him convinced that he had to be on this device where it basically, I think it was strapped him down and spun him around. And oh, he had to be on oh, it for yeah, like no. hours and hours and hours. That is um, not, yeah. No, you're just blowing no. chunks everywhere. Uh, so yeah, he's he's stepping away from the from everything, right? Ash, Ash is, um, he's basically retiring. He said, his, I'm done playing Ash. Yeah. Um, so that determines a lot of where we go with the franchise without that character. But will he do voiceovers though? Like if they stories. do a game, like if they do a game, will he do voiceovers and stuff or nah? I would, I would think so. And also I would think so too, that because they're making a new evil dead movie. Right. Um, yes. That he said, he said is awesome. I, I just wonder if the franchise, like they haven't really found a star to replace him. There but is no star to could, replace Bruce, Bruce Campbell. Like that is, right. he's, the no, chin no, no, that launched no, a thousand no. we, things. We we have two people that could replace Bruce Campbell in mm. Evil Dead. Ryan Reynolds. Yeah, and Jack. Either and one Jack of those. Black. Either one of those guys. I thought. You know what? I I take back what I said. You are correct. Those are the only two that could. Because Jack Black could literally say, "Hey, Dad, how's it going?" Yeah. Anybody believes it. That's yeah. all. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. I hate our and new show. Same I hate this show in. now. Why do I hate our own show? Oh, because I didn't subscribe to it. So make sure to like and subscribe. Otherwise, you're going to hate the show, too. How am I not subscribed to my own show? Uh, may maybe I should unsubscribe. So maybe. this is a follow-up story to what we were just talking about. Dun, dun, dun. So his final endeavor into the Evil Dead series... Which I'm sure he's still going to write. I'm sure he's still going to produce. I'm sure he's still going to have a lot of say so, Ed, but on screen. Um. Wow. You just did that chop sake thing. And I'm just going to let God, you keep talking. That sucks. <laughs> it's so that hilarious, sucks. too. It's hilarious no. and horrible all at the same time. Let me no. see if there's. It, no. it is bad, and we need to spend some time. Fixing, fixing things fixing things yeah that's that's what they call downtime and we will have that in the future whenever that is good God. so evil dead start holy crap oh, where did mm. give me a second you know what i'm gonna actually start just doing this and then talking a couple seconds later <laughs> oh I, I I wish I could figure this out. I, I what I think it is is I think we just we bogged down the computer because we get we're like oh we can totally add that we can totally add that and we just kept adding things and finally oh the computer's god. like oh my god that was so good was that so was sad. so good oh so computer was finally like screw you I am not adding anything yep. else so um the Evil Dead star Bruce Campbell says the new sequel is excruciating and dark now did he mean it was excruciating to do like it literally almost killed him or Maybe. do you think he means that when you watch it you'll be like oh my god oh my god 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I think of uh, uh, hits to the groin, and there was a lot of doing things with women. Is that the dark part or the excruciating part? I'm trying to. It's both. That both. Uh, I, I think. I think um, Bruce Campbell cannot remember words to say to bring the darkness back from the Necronomicon. Oh, he never could. To put it like away. That, do yeah. they have a series if he can? Like, that's really the question. Like, right. if Bruce Campbell got the words right on the first try, pretty much the series is over. And we might as well just all it's go over. home. It's over. Thanks for watching this segment of the TP Show. 